to go on the ice tonight. Hi, everybody. I'm James Cebulski. This series has been sensational to this point. Let's see if it continues tonight. Enough talk, enough hype. Let's do this. Your first period is set to go. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Penalty coming up as the play's blown dead. Start of the game, you want to set the tempo and dictate pace, and now you're killing a penalty. Points got an opportunity to help the power play score here, guys. One way he can do that is by using his zone ability to get them going. Let's see how it goes here. They win the faceoff here in the road end and take possession. Trying to clear the puck. And they put it off the glass and out. Now the shorthanded unit, they find a way to get you this puck first, James. And the tough part there is you've got to get it on your stick and off your stick quick, as you know the power play unit is going to be coming. Trying to shake loose. He's in. Stones him on the breakaway. We got a whistle as the puck's frozen. Points at the faceoff dot, ready to win this draw on the man advantage. The Rangers will start off on the attack after winning the draw. The Bulls have it against the wall. Radish is lugging the puck. And that was read perfectly. What a play by Kreider. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Quick shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. He's got a gift to read and anticipate the play, and when he drops into that butterfly position, not only is he as big as possible and covers the top half, but he's agile enough to slide across to cover the lower half. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. The Bolts get nothing here on this power play. We're back to even strength. Well, being on a power play is a privilege, James. Trust me, I know I was never on it. When you get out there, you have to have some urgency and find a way to get it to the middle of the ice and get some opportunities on net. There was none of that. No room for that one to get through. A chance! With the stop. New York's got a hold of the puck now. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Goes right to the crease! There's so many moving parts in the game of hockey, which is why it's one of the most difficult sports in the world. And he gets to that prime time scoring area. You don't get that too often, and he just sails it and misses the net. New York's got control of it now from their own end. Freeze up the puck. Tampa Bay's got it in their own zone. Moves it to Stampos. Massive collision in the open ice. Some players get into the game by physically engaging early. There's a fine line there, but that was executed perfectly. The bolts carried along the wall. Oh, he hammered him. Oh, uh, he knew exactly what he was doing going into this along the boards, James. I love that it was a clean hit. He finishes it off perfectly. New York's got the puck along the wall. Pumped away by the goaltender. Picked up along the wall by DeHaan. Takes the pass. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. Play whistle dead offside the call. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Still no score in this one. The Rangers take control of the faceoff. Both sides mixed up for that battle for the puck along the wall. New York's got the puck in their own end. And they'll dump it in. The Lightning have taken possession along the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Poked away at center by Cooley. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Miller's got it in the defensive end. Dumps it in. The Lightning have gained control of the puck in their own zone. And now it's over to Purvix. Taken by Cooley. Gets a hold of the puck here at his own end. Here we go. Puck's in deep. The Lightning have possession along the boards. Quick feed to Mott. 
Tampa Bay's got it along the wall. And he loses control of the puck. The Rangers gain possession. Facey's carrying it ahead. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Rocks him on the play. Tampa Bay's got the puck here in the open ice. Fires it on net and makes the save. There's a chance in front. Oh, he comes up with a stop. Past the midway mark in this period, the game is still scoreless. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. Kako's got it into offensive territory. Makes the save, but barely with that one. Here in the late goings of the period, we're still scoreless. The Rangers win the draw, and they go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Oh, love the defensive stick work there to poke that one away. Across the line. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Inside the offensive and now down the left. Moves it quickly over to Gustafson. The Lightning have gained possession off the wall. Pass across to Hagel. And a stick in the lane deflects that one away. Quick pass to Gustafson. Tries to get the puck over to Kreider. Great poke check on the reach. Through center along the wing. And now it's grabbed. Oh, the save on the play. What an incredible save. No idea how he got to that one, James. And the shooter is absolutely stunned. What a stop. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Grabs the puck. And that goes off a player. Good Rose made an incredible play there, James. He stumbles in front of the net, but finds the puck and could have lost it, but manages to stay with it enough to get a shot off. Period number one in the books. First intermission entertainment is on deck here. You can also have time to go grab a drink, grab a hot dog, and we'll be back with period number two in moments. Fans back in their seats. Teams are on the ice. They're ready to drop the puck here for period number two. Both teams still feeling each other out as we are scoreless here to start the second. Well, we've seen a pretty good sample size already played thus far. Cheryl, your assessment. The Bolts have generated a ton of shots, been really aggressive in the offensive zone in particular, James. I think they're going to get need to get more in that front presence if they want to put it by the tenders, having an outstanding game. Here's a short pass to point. One times it. Oh, gets a trapper on that one as he just got enough of it. Puck scooped up by Kreider. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. New York's ready to go on the attack. Moves it to Sabinajan. Oh, he saved it! Oh my goodness, what a stop! Oh, that's unbelievable, James. I have no idea how he got to that puck. It's some gymnastics at its finest. Takes the feed at the point. Oh, he got all of that! What a save by Vasilevsky! Well, that shot came quick and it was right out front. He had to be sharp. He had to be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. Such an impressive save, James. And I love to look at these ones again because it's not just being in great position, it's being desperate. It's finding a way to get to the puck, keeping your eye on it at all times, tracking it, out-battling and out-willing everyone around you. Hedman's a solid player in the D zone, guys. His stick-em-up zone ability means he can use a timely poke check to disrupt his opponent's attack. The Rangers win the draw. Oh, and a huge save. And the play continues. Puts it on net and makes the save. And they continue to fight for that puck along the wall. Sends a pass over. Poked away in the offensive zone by Panarin. And he denied that opportunity. Look at this attack here in the O-zone. And we'll get a reset after the puck goes up and out of play. 
Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Still scoreless in this one. And off the draw, they take the puck. Quick feed to Stamkos. And he takes the dish. Great defensive effort with the stick. Moves it quickly over to Stamkos. From point blank! What a stop with the paddle by Shesterkin! Well, he's one of the best in the game in terms of that butterfly position. And once he drops, he's so agile to be able to slide across the net. Pass it up ahead. The Bolts cross the line and gain the zone. Shuts him down. The Rangers gain control of the puck. Quick pass to Lafreniere. Slick feed. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. Taken by Lindgren. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Takes the feed. Puck picked up by Stamkos. What a stop at point blank range by Shesterkin. His shot's come from the middle of the ice and it has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position and he makes the save. Some last second communication before both teams get ready to drop the puck here. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Takes that pass back at the point. Steps in with the block. Here's a short pass to Miller. New York's moving it into the offensive end. Tampa Bay is looking to break out of their own end. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Trying to get back on the attack now. Takes it into the slot. And that's blocked from someone in front. Tampa Bay's got the puck along the boards. Moves it past them all. The Lightning have the puck in the open ice. The Rangers gain possession in their own end. And he handles a cross-ice pass. Return pass. Here's a shot. Pad save, and he made it look easy. Great job there. Denies him again. Mott's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Slides the puck across to Chernak. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And here comes the judgment from the official. Natural tendency for players is to reach when they've lost position on their opponent. When you reach, often you take out the feet of your opponent. This is an easy tripping call. Another power play opportunity coming up here as they set up at the base off. No, they haven't scored on the power play yet. 100% is not a number that we see typically. So they've got to find a way to just stay confident, trust the process and their skill sets. The Lightning have the puck against the boards. Stopped by the goaltender. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Kucherov's tape-to-tape -tape zone ability means he can complete those firm, crisp passes that help keep the play moving. He's so effective at distributing the puck and setting up his teammates. Trying to clear. They get it done. The Lightning have gained control of the puck along the wall. Here they come. Puck grab by Point. Big-time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. Whenever he gets in close quarters, it's almost a gimme, isn't it? Well, not tonight. The goaltender comes up huge. Denied that one. Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. Slides the puck ahead to Kucherov. Quick feed to point. Centering feed. Great defensive heads-up play to pick it off. And we're going to get a face-off after the offside. The finish outside, still shorthanded here as they slide in for the faceoff. And after the draw center, they've got a hold of the puck. Ten seconds on the clock. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. The Bolts fire blanks on the power play. We're back to even strength here. Really like that power play sequence, James. The way they were moving puck and controlling the play, they came up to a hot four ten. Scores! The deadlock broken as we finally see the game's first goal. And will it hold up now? Power in the second half of the game, so it certainly took a while, James. I don't think you change your mindset now that you have the lead. You got to continue to attack and try and put in.
another one. Well, this is a quick release shot that's going to beat the goaltender low blocker side, and he couldn't catch up to it with his stick or his blocker, and it winds up in the back of the net. Tampa Bay's gone up by one here late in period number two. Well, there's not much difference in this game, James. That's why every goal matters, and they get the go-ahead heading into the intermission. If they can hold on to this, they're going to start the third period with a sense of urgency trying to hold that lead. New York's gained possession. Forces the turnover in the offensive zone. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. The Bolts have been the better team for the better part of two periods now as they lead it late in this second. Tampa Bay's won the draw and they'll go to work. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Right on the doorstep. And that's deflected off someone in front. And he coughs it up with the pass. Oh, what a save in front. To Sirkins in the right spot at the right time. Just a brilliant save. 60 seconds left in this one. Denies him in front. To Sirkins been dialed in right from puck drop, James. I mean, he's made the key saves that he's needed to make. And it's all about for a tender managing the momentum swings of the game. And the timeliness of the saves have really given his team an opportunity. Sabinajad's won a big draw on their own end. Both sides digging in for that puck along the wall. Thought we were going to get a whistle, but the puck clears up. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Here's a shot. Oh, and he reaches out with a glove save. Wow. Teams are ready for the draw. The line's been about to drop the puck. Tampa Bay's won the faceoff deep in their own end. You go. We played 40 minutes. Final chance for the coaches to push their messages home, and we'll see the third period coming up in just a matter of moments. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. And this one's underway here in the third. Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? The Rangers, coach won't be happy with their performance tonight in the effort areas and the habits. I mean, they really haven't been hard on the puck. They haven't been strong or physical. And as a result, their opponent has taken it to them because they've had the puck the entire game. And now he passes up to Kako. And that's stolen by Hagel. The Rangers have it from their own end. And that's taken away in the offensive end by Hagel. That's blown by Shusterkin. There's the whistle as the puck stopper likes to hang on. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We got a 1 0 game to this point. Tampa Bay's won the draw. And that takes guts to get in front of that one. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Sherry's taking a nasty whack, and that's going to draw a penalty. Here we go. Full tenders at the bench. They've got the extra attacker out with the delayed penalty. Here comes the call. When you're down a goal, you can't generate any offense if you're shorthanded. They're going to have to be opportunistic, find a way to kill it off, and then reset the momentum. Shisterkin's butterfly effect zone ability is when he makes himself big covers the net and still has that mobility while down to keep up and make the stop, guys. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. The Rangers scoop it up along the boards. The Bolts get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Picked up along the boards by Paul. Takes a hit on the play. Get set to drop the puck as this power play continues. And they win the draw in the offensive zone and they go to work. And that one's denied. 
Even though goaltenders get set in their butterfly positioning, they still have to be agile and be able to move across their crease. Right there, that's evidence of it and with that beautiful save. The Bolts have it against the wall. Slides it diagonally to point. Moves it over to Sorelli. Knocked away in the offensive zone. Scrum along the boards. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. And that's a smart heads up play by Kucherov. Gaining momentum up along the side. And skilled use of the stick to poke the puck away. Centering feed! And that's stopped! Oh, there's one more! A player should never be left alone in the slot, but man, is the goaltender in a task here. Gets out in front of it and makes the save. Oh, he's going to get called on that slash. And the goaltender gets to the pitch. They've got the extra attacker out. And the officials will pass the sentence here. Well, they have the lead, and now they've taken a penalty. So now they're going to be back on their heels. That power play's going to come out. You know they're going to be smelling and tasting blood, James. The PK unit, they got to be the task. Fox is out here for the power play, guys. We know he's got that zone ability, and it could be a weapon here as they try to get on the board with the special teams. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Scores! And with that, I believe that's his first career playoff goal. Well, it is, James, and it's going to feel pretty good because there's a lot of question marks around players who can't get it done in the playoffs, and he finds the back of the net. That's going to give him a big confidence boost to send him through the next game. The Rangers get the equalizer, and look at this. With the time of this game, huge, Cheryl. Huge goal with respect to timing as well, James. Not only is it the equalizer, it tells me one thing. They made the adjustments that they talked about in the intermission. A great start to the third. Moves it quickly over to Panarin. The Lightning have it in their own zone. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Picks off the pass. Quick pass across to Panarin. The Bolts get a hold of the puck in their own end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Huge steal in his own end. The Rangers take it across the blue line. Quick pass to Trocek. Back to the blue line. With the puck under siege. Can he get out of the zone here? Shot. Save. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And they take possession off the draw here at their own end. Moves the puck. Great use of the twig as he pokes that one away. Play rolls on. I was never expected to score, James, so this never really bothered me. I was always on the defensive side of it. But listen, the goaltenders had to make some huge save. Everyone's talking about the chances. How about the tenders and their positioning and the ability to move within the net? And he loses control here. Here's a short pass to Sorelli. The Bolts played along the boards. New York's got the puck. Sabinajad's got it on the offensive end. Steps in front of the shot. Passes the puck over to Mott. Odd man rush. Takes the shot. Blocked in traffic. Shot. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Shesterkin. And now it's grabbed by Vendetti. Oh, what a stop by Shesterkin. Tampa Bay's got a hold of the puck now. Sabinajad stick handling in his own zone. Moves it to Kreider. Scooped up along the wall by Kako. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. Here in the back half of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And there's the save! 
This is just great puck control to put the puck to the corner. No second shot opportunity. Can't complete the pass as it goes off a stick. Vasilevsky's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. The Rangers win that offensive zone face-off. Oh, can't get it to go. Gone is a good scoring chance. It's a quick release shot, but unable to convert. The Bolts move to the offensive zone. Here's a chance. And that goes off a of body. Denies the shooter on that play. Goaltender spent so much time doing tracking exercises, and it's utilized right here as he knows where this puck is coming from, and he makes the save. Gets it over to point. Puck sent down the ice. We'll get an icing. Late goings of this period. We got a tie game. Won the draw here in their own zone. Angles it over to Schneider. Tampa Bay's looking to break out. Great use of the stick at center by Schneider. Handles the puck. Quick feed to Sabinijad. It's a nail biter here as we approach the final minute of regulation. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Takes the feed ahead from the left side. The lane was plugged up and that shot's blocked. Shesterkin's gonna hang on to the puck and get a stoppage in play. Nothing gives confidence to a team more than a big save and he's been doing it all night, James. Centers are lined up and we are ready to resume. The Rangers win the defensive zone faceoff. And he takes the pass. Takes the feed. Shot! Close save! Covers it up, and we'll get a stoppage in play. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Tampa Bay's got a hold of the puck. Get it out of there. Moves it quickly over to Paul. And things starting to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. There's the horn bringing an end to regulation hockey, and it's been a tense one here tonight. And guess what? The intensity is going to ramp up to another level because sudden death overtime is coming up. The moment of truth has arrived. Overtime is set to go. Kucherov carries the puck through the neutral zone. Sends the pass in front, and that's intercepted. Directed over to Sabinajad. Here's a chance in front, and that doesn't connect. Tampa Bay's across the blue line. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. Quick pass to Hagel. Handles it along the blue line. Gains control of the puck here at the line. Moves it to Fox. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Tremendous play for the team as he blocks it. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. The Bolts gain control of the puck. Poked away in the neutral zone by Lindgren. The Rangers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Kreider's got it against the boards. And he takes the feed. Too much congestion in front. Played big in the moment there. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Tampa Bay's gained the line and into the zone. Reaches out and uses the stick. Kreider's taking it from his own end. Kako's got the puck. He's knocked off the puck there. Vasilevsky's opted to hang on to the puck for a faceoff. A critical draw here.
And off the draw, they win possession. Puck scooped up by Shiri. Knocked away by Stamkos. Receives the pass. New York's going on the attack as they gain the zone. Into the offensive zone, down the right wing. Here's a short pass to Paul. Oh, a clutch save! There's the whistle. Let's see what the referee saw. Well, you know your PKs and your goaltender have to stand on their head here. It's overtime, and now you're shorthanded.